If you're not familiar with this, you need to get yourself familiar with it. You can see that gentleman right over there. Mr. Forsyth right over there has put together, not put together, he has compiled. I said compiled. Can I get an amen on that? Compiled. All, this, all the Trop Rock stuff you need to know. And let me tell you, ten dollars of every sale of every one of these goes to the charity, which is what is the charity for today? No, quite seriously, this is a great book, and there's a whole lot of stuff here. And I know all these guys that are with me here will uh, will be happy to sign sign a copy of this. What chapter are you in, anyways? By the way, what chapter am I in? I don't know. I think I'm 21. Who's 21? Me. I'm chapter 21. Yeah. God, I wish I was 21 again. Here goes. Yoga pants. Yoga pants. You're just so damn comfy in those yoga pants. Blue or gray or black, they've always got your back. They got your front, they're comfy yoga pants. Yoga pants. I love the way they fold and stretch you. Do I love them? Yeah, you betcha. You ever make them turn inside out? Makes me want to scream and shout. Those yoga pants. Oh, yoga pants. Yes, they're so comfy in those yoga pants. Blue or gray or black, they've always got your back. And sometimes got your front. They've got those yoga pants. Flannel jammies sure are nice. Lingerie can add that spice. You can't wear them on the street at the intersection of ass and feet. No yoga pants. Just yoga pants. Oh, those comfy, comfy yoga pants. Blue or gray or black, they've always got your back. Sometimes they got your front. That's yoga pants. Are you getting the feeling for this? I'm trying to stretch the time out. You can wear them just almost anywhere, under here and underwear. <laughs> it doesn't matter if you're overweight, there's just more to love and less to hate with those yoga pants. <laughs> yoga pants. You're just so damn comfy in those yoga pants. Blue or gray or black, oh, they always got your back. Sometimes they got your front. Those yoga pants. Oh, we're getting to the end now, unfortunately. How they stretch my imagination. I'm a generation of the spandex generation. They're soft and cool and fit all over. You don't even have to do the yoga with those yoga pants. Yoga pants. So damn comfy in those yoga pants. Blue or gray or black, they've always got your back. Sometimes you got those comfy yoga pants. Last verse. They say that yoga lessens stress. I know they do the way you're dressed. Maybe if I got the chance, I'd like to get in your yoga pants. You know your yoga pants. Those yoga pants. Just damn comfy in those yoga pants. No cracks, please. Blue or gray or black, they've always got your back. Oh, sometimes you're front, you know those yoga pants. What I'd say? Blue or 
Lord, pray our black. They've always got your back. Sometimes they got your front doors, yoga pants. Oh, sometimes they got your front. Welcome back again. We're going to finish up the show uh, on Sunday with that uh, Putin Bay flocking to the faithful 19th anniversary. And don't forget to check out our new sponsor, Built to Last, all the chairs here. You might have seen it last week's show when we had all the chairs lined up all over here. But they've got some great products. Check out the website. And uh, we're going to see Ray Fogg doing his song, Waves, which is on Labor Day every year. The people line up on the dock and wave to the people going by. It's a great song. It actually talks about Oliver Hazard Perry, who might have been one of my relatives, from, uh, distant relatives. So enjoy the show. Keep on trop rocking. Ray Fogg, ladies and gentlemen, I'll be here in a minute. Uh, my first CD that I put out was called, uh, the once I started playing here at Port Bay anyway, it's called Waves. And uh, there's a title track from that CD. Because you probably, I guess you're having a good time putting Bay this weekend, I'm guessing you probably are, right? How could you not? How could you not? It's the funnest place on earth, I think. But it's important while you're here that you pay attention to our, our rich history and tradition. Of course, this year we're paying homage to our very most important piece of history here at Putin Bay, and that, of course, is 200 years ago, come September 10th. 200 years ago, on that date, Commodore Oliver Hazard Perry went out here to open up a big can of whoop ass in the British Navy and won the Battle of the Lake here. And you're probably, probably familiar with the note that he wrote General Harrison after the battle that said, We've met the enemy and they are ours. I'm sorry for all the history buffs here to tell you that that's not actually what the note said. It actually said, uh, We've met the enemy and we're hitting the bars. <laughs> Because even in 1813, Putin Bay was the home of the world's largest swimmer.